Hello, I'm Chris Valdez with Central Hudson. As we head into winter, it is important to understand how weather and temperature impact your energy bills. When temperatures drop, people use more energy to heat their homes. Increased demand drives higher energy costs. Central Hudson has strategies to dampen the impact of spikes in supply pricing and provide more stabilized bills. Specifically, spring and fall are transitional seasons, so you tend to get some of the wildest swings in temperature at both basically book bookends of the season. You've got a lot of com competing air masses, so you still have a lot of warmth from the south uh, trying to creep in in the fall, while the Arctic air from the north is trying to obviously make its inroads. Weather is going to have the main impact on the supply portion of the bill, because those prices are dictated by supply and demand. And in times of great demand, prices increase. And in times of abundance, prices fall. So there are two components to a Central Hudson bill, delivery and supply. The delivery portion of the bill is the portion of the bill that recovers costs for delivering the commodity to the customer, maintaining our infrastructure, and providing an array of customer services. So the supply portion of the bill is the portion of the bill that is recovering the commodity costs that were outlaid by energy resources, and we are passing those costs back to customers with no markup. Customer habits can impact load uh, based on weather, such as high heat, where customers would use AC and therefore generate high loads, or in periods of very cold when they generated their heat at night, uh, would be high loads overnight. In times of extreme cold, when customer demand is expected to increase um, accordingly, the company has to go out into the spot market and purchase um, supply to meet this demand during these times of cold weather. And what cost and rate does is incrementally recover these costs in the, in the immediate term as opposed to waiting until they're reconciled at the end of the annual period. And what we're really trying to do here is to um, mitigate um, a large over or under collection which customers would be responsible for either paying or they would receive a refund. In order to provide stable, predictable pricing profiles for our full service customers, we institute a hedging program using a three-pronged approach. One is energy hedges, another is capacity hedges, and the third is a winter weather option. The first is a financial instrument, the second is a physical instrument, and the third is also a financial instrument which is used during uh, peak weather periods during December through March. So we use past weather data, past load data, and that's how we figure out, okay, how much do we think we're gonna need um, going into each month for the each season, winter and summer. Every season going into the winter, we're always going to have these options set up so that way, yeah, if an extreme winter did occur, we have these hedging products that can help dampen price volatility and um, help alleviate prices for customers. The thoughts on this winter is that it's going to be snowier than last winter. That would be my small little tidbit before we get to the actual release of the winter outlook. While Central Hudson works to dampen your bills, we encourage you to do your part by installing energy efficient equipment, insulating your homes, and being mindful of when you use major appliances, you could significantly reduce your energy use. You could also sign up for budget billing to avoid seasonal fluctuations in supply pricing. Budget billing spreads your payments evenly over 11 months, so you will receive consistent and predictable energy bills. Visit our website, www.centralhudson.com, for more information.